Hello friends, uh, today we will learn about citation and referencing tool out of many others uh, there is one known as Mendeley. Basically it is aimed to improve the quality of write up uh, by inserting citation while one is writing and prepare the references or bibliography text in a very organized manner that too very quickly. Uh, one can uh, very easily switch over to different uh, formats of referencing styles uh, like APA or Chicago style and, and many more. So let us uh, move ahead uh, with the lecture. This uh, video is not basically a promotional one to advertise about the Mendeley uh, or any other manner. Uh, the video is prepared and published by me in the mutual benefit of the students, researchers and writers. Uh, basically, which is aimed to spread awareness on uh, good writing practices. And it is uh, licensed under Creative Commons, share alike and non-commercial usage. Uh, many of the time we have been uh, coming across uh, examples like this one, that even though uh, much of the stuff copied from the internet, uh, but it is not giving you the credits. Uh, why, why this happens? Because it is basically considered as a crime. Uh, uh, if not proper citation given or uh, the original work is not referred uh, in a systematic manner. So we need to avoid the plagiarism that is basically a copy paste business. Uh, generally students uh, carry out this uh, uh, task unknowingly to improve their uh, or rather increase the volume of the text. Uh, mostly it happens uh, in the literature review uh, tasks that they carry out while performing projects or any sort of research activities. Uh, this means that the original writing is very well required and uh, if uh, one is using somebody else's idea or text, uh, one need to reproduce it in a different manner. Uh, uh, rather basically it is a reproduction of the original work uh, but uh, maybe the context or the intervention is a different by connecting so many other aspects along with. Uh, so it is also very much uh, important to provide credit to one actually who is responsible for the originality of idea and for that purpose we need to uh, make a citation to the original author of the particular uh, text or image or whatsoever resources we are using for uh, producing our own work. So to produce uh, quality text uh, in, in form of uh, articles for the newspaper or the magazines or research paper for journals or report documents, maybe in terms of professional reports or it could be academic report for the project or research work, uh, we need to provide proper citation and references. Uh, this website uh, of SlideShare uh, contributes uh, a work from uh, Ms. Anne Pisani uh, here is the link of the website uh, wherein one can go through the basics about citation references, the list of it and bibliography, what does that mean and uh, actually how they are used in the preparation of a document. Now citing if we see here the basic definition from the very presentation, when one refers to another author's work in uh, one's work, uh, one must cite the source by providing the last name of the author and the year of the publication. Now this uh, can be done uh, either manually or uh, by automatically. Now, uh, let us say if you are using 100 of articles and uh, for preparation of a certain literature review, then it is uh, becoming a very cumbersome job to identify each one and then uh, provide citations this way. And at the end of the document, uh, one needs to provide a list of references, uh, giving the full description of each of the sources one has cited along the document. So it is the addition to this cumbersome job, uh, that too in an alphabetical order. So it, it consumes a lot of time and energy and uh, uh, it makes the task actually difficult to produce the original work. So to help it out, uh, uh, many a time it happens that uh, good quality research papers are there, but then a uh, lot of citations are there, but uh, to be on lighter side, they are all self citations. In absence of uh, any of the citation, uh, it becomes uh, obvious that whatever is written is written by you originally uh, when you are not citing somebody else's work. But this is uh, 
uh, another way of intentional or uh, non-intentional copy paste uh, uh, writing and liable for the plagiarism so to aid uh, to help it out uh, there is a platform developed uh, an application developed uh, that is uh, known as mendeley basically it is a package as a free reference manager a uh, single username is required uh, gen to be generated only for once uh, that is a uh, very well usable on the Mendeley website. Now this website itself provides a kind of a social network among the researchers and writers. And it, it has a fantastic uh, uh, interface, very easy to use. And then uh, one get acquainted to use it very uh, quite nicely. The a desktop application is also available uh, uh, that uh, Mendeley has developed uh, using different platforms. Uh, that can be installed on the personal computer and from the created uh, website ID the access can be made to this apart from that while uh, in, in the era of uh, online browsing and uh, citation is uh, uh, made very easy for uh, the browser through the browser extensions that Mendeley has created and the mobile application is also available so either one is using an Android mobile phone or I iPhone by Apple uh, on these platforms the mobile applications are available through the uh, application stores and one can carry over their work uh, and simultaneously appropriately cite all the work that is been requ uh, required to be referred to so basically uh, on multiple devices uh, using certain cloud based applications like uh, google drive or onedrive which allows the pop production of uh, online documents uh, this bendler tool can help uh, out the referencing job uh, simultaneously one can carry over the entire reference library for certain work as such the mendeley provides the cloud based services and it is very easy to create and insert a list of referred sources uh, like in no time apart from that uh, one can change the format of references and bi bibliography as i mentioned earlier just a few clicks away so let us have a demonstration over the uh, mendeley website as soon as you enter the address on your uh, browser mendeley.com you can see this sort of uh, screen in front of you uh, one can very easily create a free account in here and uh, once the account is created the mac based or uh, windows based or uh, linux based or android based applications can be downloaded by clicking over here so basic uh, understanding about this uh, mandalay website is help out the showcase of the impact on the work and uh, also it allows to share and collaborate between the lists and references and full text articles uh, within the network uh, publicly or privately whichever way one uh, wishes to do so apart from that is as i said it is all through cloud based services uh, on multiple devices uh, one can use this facility and uh, while one is reading a particular website or a pdf document simultaneously annotations and uh, citations can be provided uh, so this is about it and basically the as soon as you click on the particular uh, uh, icon of uh, let us say uh, windows downloading of this application it will ask for the sign in uh, sign in function so one needs to create an account here and as soon as that is done uh, one uh, has this sort of page in front of uh, in front of the browser and then downloading of the mendeley desktop application can be done from here so as soon as this application is there uh, we can see that this desktop application is here and once you open it you have this sort of interface in front of you it is very easy uh, there are uh, these applications available on the google apps uh, chrome store web store is there uh, as such i am right now using this and then i just need to provide uh, the uh, application name here and i will be redirected to mendeley's importer here so i have already downloaded this and uh, it is added uh, it is shown as added in here and asking for rating that i am going to give uh, sooner so once it is there let me uh, make a demonstration of how this can be useful that uh, from a website of gidc uh, i am assuming to uh, refer to certain text that i have read over here and then i am making a citation of it uh, some uh, in a particular document so uh, this uh, 
this web page uh, is open and this uh, browser extension to mendeley uh, as soon as i'll click it i it will ask me for this sign up uh, sign in rather and once i am logged in i have this uh, sort of uh, uh, image in front of me wherein i am uh, this title and authors most of the text are uh, caught by the uh, this interface automatically if not then one it, one can enter the details relevant details manually as well so this website uh, nowhere i could find that which in which year this website was created so uh, uh, I, I clicked on this uh, particular policy which was uh, created in uh, 31st of december 2014 so i assume that this page was created on 2014 or maybe here it is shown that last modification was made on uh, august of 2016 but this seems to be a common for uh, entire of this website and not a page specific one so i i write this uh, here as 2014 the page number is uh, in case of uh, there are multiple pages we can cite the number of pages as well and then uh, the date of access uh, i have added in here so this url is automatically uh, grabbed by these uh, uh, mendeley's uh, uh, application so as soon as i am saving it in here uh, it is saving here and it is uh, saved as a reference these are the basic text here and uh, i'll go back to the mendeley platform and i just synchronize it uh, in in a moments i'll be able to see that it is already there on my desktop and as soon as i am inserting some word file and tourism policy uh, i have ins uh, installed the uh, mendeley desktop so it automatically integrates here uh, insert citation here and uh, it will ask me about the particular thing uh, as soon as i am writing here it fetches automatically the source in uh, from here and then all i need is just to click and enter so formatting citation it is automatically formatted and when i need to prepare a list of uh, references i'll need to insert the bibliography in uh, whichever format that i will uh, like to enter uh, it will reformat it just a click away like in no time so this is how it works and it helps uh, the write up very nicely in uh, in like in no time so this is all about Thank you.